Hello, friends. In this episode, Nancy and I had the opportunity to visit the Black Bear Diner while we were in the Houston area. We visited the Shenandoah location. This diner was super adorable with its bear theme. It is definitely a hidden gem in the diner industry if you happen to be an animal lover or simply love a rustic setting. The Black Bear Diner has multiple chains in the Western United States. This restaurant dishes out your favorite comfort foods, which are served in an old-fashioned and home-style manner. In 1995, the first restaurant was opened in Mount Shasta, California, and it was founded by Bob, Lori Manley, and Bruce Dean. Redding, California is where the company is currently based. Black Bear Diner currently has 143 locations, which encompass 14 states. The over-the-top bear paraphernalia at the Black Bear Diner includes a rustic motif, making you feel like you are dining in a cozy cabin somewhere in the woods. There's also a 12-foot tall, 3.7 meter black bear carving that greets you at every restaurant. That was carved by artist Ray Schultz. At these diners, there are also additional artwork and murals which were created for each restaurant by Steve and Gary Fitzgerald and Colleen Mitchell Vena. The menu format mimics an old newspaper that is titled The Black Bear Gazette. This includes articles explaining how the Black Bear Diner partners with wildlife in saving bear populations. The Berry Tale is the children's menu, which is similarly styled as the Gazette with a delicious menu focused on fresh ingredients, serving well-known staples such as club sandwiches, cheeseburgers, and classic dinners like pot roast and roasted turkey. With service based on genuine hospitality, this diner offers a vast inviting menu, anchored in large portions with excellent value. Serving breakfast, lunch, and dinner, the Black Bear Diner is the winner of FSR Magazine's 2021 Reader's Choice Award for Best Legacy Brand, a top 10 customer service winner with an emphasis on family dining and a reverence for the mighty American Black Bear. An old-timey style with wooden furniture offers diners a cozy glimpse of cabin-themed spaces. One of the things we discovered while dining there was their affinity for wildlife, nature, and animals. Nancy and I are always glad to find places that support animal rescue and have a genuine interest in nature, assisting to protect flora and fauna. As we all know, Nancy is a huge animal lover. Discovering that this restaurant assists in the rescue of wildlife was definitely a nice and welcome surprise. Also, on October 20th, 2021, they announced the launching of a capital fundraising campaign with Gold Country Wildlife Rescue for a new bear rehabilitation facility with the name of Bear Cub University. Over $17,000 was raised by the Black Bear Diner through corporate sponsorship, employee donations, and franchises to support three bear cubs recently injured in the California wildfires in the summer. With a goal to raise a total of $250,000, the new Bear Cub University will feature an enclosure at the Wildlife Center that will provide the space and enrichment required for bear cubs to develop the skills they need, like foraging, to successfully return to the wild. Wildlife Disaster Network, along with Auburn's Gold Country Wildlife Rescue, is providing critical care for three bear cubs, Leo, Reggie Taylor, and Vinny, are recovering from burns on their paws and ears, among other injuries. When we saw the devastating effects of the Antelope and Dixie wildfires in our backyard to our beloved bears, we knew we had to find a way to assist with their recovery, said Anita Adams, CEO of Black Bear Diner. With the help of our team members and franchise partners, we are proud to support Gold Country Wildlife Rescue's efforts and look forward to seeing the cubs return to their natural habitat. As a nonprofit, we rely solely on donations and grants to drive our mission to rescue, rehabilitate, and release the orphaned, injured, and critically ill wildlife that we receive at our intake center every day, said Sally Sue Stein, Gold Country Wildlife Rescue Founder and Acting Executive Director. We are incredibly grateful to Black Bear Diner for recognizing the immediate need to help these three little bears and future bears who will benefit from our Bear Cub University. If you would like to donate to Bear Cub University, we will provide a link to this organization in the description box below. The Black Bear Diner is also aiding with donations to Gold Country Wild Rescue. This is a nonprofit organization dedicated to rehabilitation and rescue, including the release of orphaned and injured wildlife simultaneously promoting human awareness of the ecosystems and wildlife we share, providing their wildlife care services free of charge to the public, solely depending on donations and grants. The nature-based, heavily wooded Flair restaurant, the Black Bear Diner, definitely shows a love of Mother Nature going above and beyond mere aesthetics. In an effort to further showcase their appreciation for the environment, 
The award-winning chain made the honorable decision to help support the National Park Foundation's centennial campaign for America's national parks. Its mission, conserve and preserve more than 84 million acres of natural landscapes and help the community behold the marvelous wonders of the natural world. The National Park Foundation and the Black Bear Diner teamed up for National Park Week to raise more awareness about the importance of community investments in our national park system. Unfortunately, wildfires during the summer increasingly rage across the country. More animals are being deeply affected by the blazing wreckage, including bears, calling for a halt to bear hunting by wildlife advocates in areas devastated by fire, emphasizing allowing bears proper time to recuperate. The Thin Blue Lane truly enjoys finding new places to experience, dine, and share with you all. It is especially a breath of fresh air when we find places like this. Nancy and I love to bring patronage to restaurants and shops whose business model follows support for animal and wildlife organizations. We hope that you've enjoyed this video. If you liked the video, hit that like button. We also would like to know if there are any restaurants you have visited that support wildlife rescue. Please let us know in the comments below. We'd love to hear about them. If you really enjoyed this video, consider subscribing and ring the notification bell to be notified when new videos are released. If you know someone who would enjoy this dining experience, share this video with them. It really helps the channel out, and we sure appreciate it.